Bang. Bang. Cave. Good morning, everybody. It's a nice early box who filled morning. Got some lovely stuff from you. Always move it out of the. It's in a perfect. Look at this alignment. It was Make so sure straight. there's nothing on your phones you don't want stream maybe seeing because I'm flipping the camera to geez, this one. Okay, we'll go over here. Oh, we don't need that either. Welcome. Good morning. Hi, I'm hungry. Yeah, hey hungry. I'm Boxu. Feed me. Yeah, all right. Well, <laughs> <laughs> what are you waiting for? The box is still closed and I am still hungry. It's very pretty, by the way. It's oh so pretty. Goodness. I am taking it. It's my box. January yeah. Boxu. Nanny was very firm in his desire to have this box this morning. I was very clear about it. I Give offered up your room, live in this box instead. Yes. Yeah. I offered other Ooh. boxes and none of them were good Ooh. enough. So much of it looks soft and squishy. Oh, I know. Hey, Boxu oh, buddies. Ring cake. Oh. Oh. I'm excited for that. That's Happy New Year. Oh, <laughs> there is uh, there is some Japanese writing up here. Hey, Boxu buddies is not Happy New Year in Japanese. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> you saved us from a long, like a lot of awkwardness. I, know. I was like, Hey, Boxu buddies. I'm like, I'm gonna skim right over that. That's Happy New Year's in Japanese. I'm like, Oh wait, no, that doesn't sound right. Oh yeah, wait a minute. Uh, what? A... Uh, forget it. Uh, in Japan, it's common to send. Ningajo. Ningajo. Or New Year's cards in December that arrive in January. They let your friends and family know how you're doing and spread some holiday cheer. Think of this as your Ningajo. That's a tough word. From the Boxu family. And may your 2020 be full of happiness, good fortune, and of course, great snacks. <laughs> oh, Danny. <laughs> Wink. Danny is Happy so snacking and happy holidays from Danny Kang. Founder. Thanks Danny. Thanks, Danny. Danny is a solid foundation. Of good things. We should probably start off with the tay. Tea. The tia. The tia. Not for that, we're picking it random. Oh yeah. Um I just don't want this water. Hakone mm -hmm. Sanroku Black Tea Akafuji. Mm. These tea bags feature a famous print of Akafuji, a phenomenon known in English as Diamond Fuji, where the morning sun lines up with the peak of Mount Fuji and turns it red. This black tea is a blend of leaves from local Kanagawa tea makers chosen for their fine quality. The flavor is bold and a bit fragrant, almost floral, if you will. It's also quite smooth and less astringent than some other black teas. Oh, man. Everything's a mess now. I still remember that one treat that made me believe in love again. Oh, yeah. I forget I all of last box other than the fact that I remember it, it was, was amazing. amazing. Amazing box. Well, you got to get yeah. some uh, some O ring cake. Oh, <laughs> I, don't you worry. I want some O ring cake. What, so like what, are the, wait, what, are the what are the instructions for this? I'm just putting it in. Uh, brewing instructions. One, place in hot water. Two, steep for two minutes two or to minutes. taste. Okay. Well, here you go. Look at that. You get to do it for two minutes or to taste. Boop. Boop. All right. All right, Nanny, I, which one do you want? Yeah. I pick? Mm -hmm. Yeah, pick. Mm -hmm. Pick with your eyes. Use your eyes and assess the goddamn situation. I want ring cake. Oh, buddy. Ring wow. Cake, ring cake. Oh. Starting it off with ring cake. Oh. Mm. Oh, oh, ring cake. I yes. didn't expect that I would be allowed to uh, choose. I don't want to. Oh, well, no, that this is fine. I don't want to cut the food with those. Those are dirty. They're so, so dirty. I'll get the knives. Very bad. I could just eat the ring, the ring cake. Oh, and I, you wouldn't have to cut it at all. I feel less safe. About. Well, I just feel less safe. Ooh. I feel like I'm in danger. But because of ring cake. Oh, I guess so. Show ring the, cake. Show oh, everybody ring no. cake. Oh. Ooh, it's so oh, moist. Look it's at that. it's so moist. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get the camera to look through it. I want my eyes to be right there. Why is that? Is that cinnamon on the top? I don't know. I can't smell it. Mm, ooh! It ooh, look at how nice it is. Mm. It kind of smells like a pancake with maple syrup on it. A pancake? Yeah, it oh. smells like a pancake. It smells like the inside of an IHOP. Oh yeah? Which is the International House of Pancake Burgers or something. <laughs> Doesn't it not stand for that anymore? Oh, it's know. Wiz's birthday. I saw in chat. Happy Wiz's birthday! Oh, hey, of 
Okay. I got too excited because there was food and I'm hungry. <laughs> and so I, I remember like, ooh, don't forget to say happy birthday to Wiz. Don't forget to say happy birthday to Wiz. And then I saw Ring Cake O and I it was gone. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ring Cake O. Ring Cake O. The symmetry in motion. One of them is not super symmetry, but uh Nyeni, are you ready to catch a ring cake? Um okay. Oh my god. They're so soft though. Yeah. I'd full Oh 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 no, you gotta give it. Gotta Smell give it though, it smells like a pancake. Oh give it, give it, give it. Don't, don't Ooh, it off. smells yes. like it's got molasses mm. in it. Oh. oh look at that bottom. It tastes like a pancake. Honestly, this is the perfect coffee snack. Wow, mm. it does mm. smell like a pancake. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I caught it. This is worth it. I love the oat cake. Mm. Mm. Very yeah. good. It's it's mm -hmm. like a, a, an adequately saturated pancake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Try dipping it in the tea. I, I, oh. I, oh, black tea would be really good with this. <sighs> mm. Yes. That would have been awesome with mm -hmm. tea. Mm. That is that is quite nice. Mm. It's like a fluffy, moist pancake that has been drenched in maple syrup. Mm -hmm. There you go. Well, that was delicious. I would give that a nine five. Oh right. wow! Sorry, I forgot wow. to write down things. That's my kind of treat. The it was really tasty. I'm gonna give it a, a solid eight. Solid, really eight. solid. It's oh, my kind of snack. It's got that mm. savory butteriness, you know. It's delicious. It just it needed a wow factor. Nine for, nine for me. I could eat a lot of those, and Clay gave it a nine five. Mm -hmm. Oh man, it seems like we're gonna. See. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yokohama caramel right. ring cake. Right. Sanyo Busan was mm. founded in 1962, and since then has been sharing the history and culture of Yokohama with the next generation through their products. This ring cake is soaked with a caramel sauce, which keeps it soft and sweet. After dipping each cake in the caramel sauce, it is. Brulee to give it the lovely color on top to really amp up the caramel flavor the caramel paste and caramel powder are used in the batter Though some may find this cake a bit too sweet hmm. We recommend pairing it with an earthy or dark tea to balance it out Raga gave it an 8 and a 9.5 with the tea if you dip Ooh, it. It's true. Mm, you it's can true. really taste the caramel 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 mm. Caramel. Mm. So is that what bruleeing is? It's, it's lighting it on fire. Yeah on fire on the top fire I just thought the name of the dessert was creme brulee. It's no. just fire cream. No. Yeah, fire cream. <laughs> fire cream. Cream brulee. Oh, is that broil? Like did we probably. That probably. And then broil? Probably, yeah. Mm, broil. Interesting. Um what was it? I don't know. I don't know. Kera, era, oh, yeah. Caramel. Caramel. We say caramel here. Mm. I tried saying caramel one time, caramel? and no one understood what I was trying to say. Really? That's yeah. bold. I know. Like, like I went to a Starbucks, and I was like, can I get a caramel macchiato? And they're like, what the fuck okay. is that? What? I was like, I'll, I'll just yeah, get the caramel that. macchiato. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, you don't have caramel? No worries. Sorry. I'll get caramel instead. <laughs> yeah, basically. I chickened out on it real quick. Real quick. Because I, like, I was like, am I wrong? <laughs> am I wrong? No. Is the world wrong? Yes. You, everyone is correct. Because it's spelt caramel. 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 Caramel, not caramel. 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 Um, mm. And we all really remember like the Arrow uh, commercial where it's like, I love caramel. Oh, mm. yeah. The bubble, the no, mountain. No, no, wait, there was no caramel. This was a caramel arrow. Yeah, there was one with caramel Okay, in well, it. that's caramel then. And yeah. it, it's yeah, like, is that caramel? Bubble, bubble? I love caramel. caramel. Yeah, I do. I remember the exact one. God damn it. Yeah. Just wet him, wet him out. All right, Nanny, which one? Yeah. Why is it always me? Let's open that fish. It's gone now. This looks cute. Oh, look at that fish. That's a cute fish. Mato. Oh, it's swimming away. Better go catch it. Interestingly, in Finnish, karameli just means candy. Oh, interesting. Well, I mean, caramel is actually just cooked sugar, basically, with some cream. It's crazy That's how easy it is to you. make. <gasps> it's oh. another fish. I've been in this world before. No fish heads. Ah! Oh, oh, so smooth. I don't think that should be thrown. That's going to make crumbs everywhere. Yeah, it's everywhere. crumbs everywhere. Mm. <laughs> you get the fish head, Nanny. Eat them up. Yum. You get the fish ah, butt. I touched the butt. You get the fish butt. Oh, man, that's chocolate. 
in looking inside of this. Yo, that's chocolate. Yo. <laughs> like me. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Yep. Ooh, look at the textures. Like, hot damn, look at that. There's so many layers. Ooh, and by that I mean bubbles. Mmm. It's like eating a very cheap ice cream cone filled with arrow. It's like very, eating a very expensive arrow covered in a wafer. <laughs> That's a nicer way to say that. The, uh, mm, so I was fluffy. betrayed by the amount of chocolate I thought was going to be in it versus the amount of chocolate that actually is. It's so bubbled, which I'm blown away how they even do. What type of bubbling oh. technology is this? I'm going to go bubble. And then I, uh, um, very good though. I give it an eight. Mm -hmm. I think eight is sufficient. It as doesn't. Well. It doesn't have my buttery, my mm -mm. buttery goodness. Mm -mm. It, the flavors were rather two dimensional, mm -mm. although they are mm -mm. quite enjoyable. The I chocolate can see wafer. This it's very good though. Yeah. Being a, a very popular sm snack among children. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is the quintessence of chocolate. So the quintessence. Quintessence. The quintessence of light and fluffy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the quintessence. Yeah, because you, you know what? It's actually a testament to how good boxes <laughs> are that this snack is for me. <laughs> also an eight. Uh, Actually, you know what? Seven five. I died. <laughs> Did you inhale some of the cookie dust? Uh, maybe. Mm. Oi! No, that thing. That thing was really tasty. This song is aggressive. We don't need aggression in this snackery. Yeah, thing. that's why. Gazuntite. Ah, bagpipes though. Puka puka tie. Chocolate. Our favorite chocolate fish is swimming mm. back to us. Chock full of chocolate goodness. This airy, moose-filled treat is also full of calcium. This treat is a variation of the Monica. A hey, traditional hey, Japanese Monica. confection featuring two layers of mochi wafers encasing a sweet filling. This modern update replaces the traditional azuki red bean filling with chocolate mousse. Thai, red snappers, are common around the new year because of their red color wards off evil spirits. Mm. And Thai is in the word meretai. Meaning celebration. Oh. Meretai. Omereto. Omeretai. Oh, Is omeretai like I want to celebrate? Maybe? No, that doesn't make sense. No me tai. No me tai. Yeah. I want to drink. Meretai. So maybe meretai is like, let's celebrate. Well, meretai apparently means celebration. Celebration. Period. So <laughs> maybe it's a tie covered in ties. That'd be a pretty meta tie for me. <laughs> Thanks for the <laughs> blessings, guys. All right, Nanny, which one? Unless Tom wants to pick. I'll pick one more. The one that's right by Tom's shoulder. Oh. This one? Yeah. Uh, looks like that one. Yeah, that one there. That one there. Only this one. Okay. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. It's a freaking kiwi? The is that a freaking kiwi? What the fuck is going on here? This is so cool. On the package, it definitely looks I like I gotta it. let you in on this, guys. Whoa. That's I know, a lime. I know that's a lime on the front, but inside. It's a green lemon, actually. <laughs> inside, it looks like a kiwi. It does look like... That looks a lot like a kiwi. I know. This camera seems to like words. Oh man. But yeah, green green lemon is what it says. Green lemon project. Okay. Green okay. lemon project. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, we're gonna eat some science. I would yep. eat science. Oh. The green oh, lemon was experimented wow. on for many years wow. until its sun okay. escaped, and now, yellow lemon looks for mother. Focus. Focus. Oh yeah. Focus. I focus. To look focus. Into if it, where the auto focus is. There we go. Oh yeah, because once it auto focuses, is it heavy? It's it's a pretty dense boy. It feels like there's something inside of it based on the looks of it. Oh my god, it looks like it is harboring some sort of. It's pregnant. 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 Oh man, I kind of want to oh, read this one before you we eat it. Oh, you two were right. Oh, you. Sh I was thinking you should cut it to four. Oh no, maybe you're wrong. Oh, maybe not. Okay. Well, it smells like lemon. That is for sure. Give you the inside scoop here. Mm. Oh shoot! Everything's oh, kind of, it smells delightful. This is probably gonna be really good with, with cake. It smells like a lemon poppy seed muffin. Oh baby! Mm. Oh yeah, definitely some oils. You can see on my hands. There. Oh yeah, it, it's it's moist. It's quite oily. It's very dense. Like I can't. It, it feels soft, but I can't even squish it. Such. I'm eating it. Oh my god! I'm eating it. It's delightful. It's gorgeous. I love it. Mm. 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 It tastes like mm. it has some rinds in it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love mm. rinds. Yeah, little little candied rinds. Mm -hmm. mm. Little chewy bits. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. Wow, mm -hmm. very lemon. Mm. Mm. 
Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, That's mm -hmm. a nine point five for me. Mm -hmm. I love that. I love mm -hmm. that lots. Mm -hmm. mm. I'll give it a nine. Mm -hmm. Very good with the tea, by the way. It's the perfect uh, like it's like citrus and sweet, whereas the tea is kind of earthy mm -hmm. and bitter. I love it. Mm, wow, but not too bitter. No, you know what? Yeah. Hot dang! Ooh, so tough. I've been so harsh on this. Mm. I'm gonna go with eight five. It was delicious. This is a top quality products. I like that one a lot. Mm. Mm. What a TVC. All right. Mm. I, a mm. lemon is a, a flavor I, I enjoy as well, Rhea. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm. Buy some oh, of those man. lemons. A oh, lemon poppy seed muffin. I kind of want to steal them. Next time we go to Costco, I want to get some of them muffins. Ooh, nice too. Mm. All right, Yanny, where's the net? Where are we going next on this? We have adventure? to read about the green lemon. Project. <gasps> oh, we didn't even. Oh my goodness. Mm, delicious though. Very citrus. Very mm. cake. Very moist. <clears throat> Shonan green lemon cake. This cake features a citrus unique to Kanagawa, a shonan green lemon. The zest of the lemon is mixed straight into the cake batter for a super citrusy flavor. This maker is based in Yokohama and developed this cake to celebrate this regional ingredient. This cake is one of our favorite examples of how they combine traditional with the new in their French-inspired treats. We've never had a cake so deliciously lemony before, mm -hmm. and the wonderful crumb of this cake just keeps it subdued enough to be sweet. Oh. Oh, damn. 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 Ooh. Did you see something? Are we going on an adventure? I, I did. I'm going to cheat here, I guess. Oh, my goodness. Don't watch to avert your eyes. Oh, well, let's just do this. Wait, uh, is there wait, two of them? Are there two of these? Oh, my God. I think there are. Oh, my God, there are. Are they different, though? No. No, they're not. I'm so Sometimes curious. Well, uh, this isn't what I was going for, but I'll, I'll take yeah, it. Yeah, anyway. we'll take it. We'll take it. Oh, oh no! It's no! Funny. We, we said the other one tasted like pancakes. Well, <laughs> how about you get literal pancakes? Small, delicious pancakes. Ah! Oh, eat me! Torokke! Hot to cakey! Hot to cakey! Hot to cakey! Okay. So they're the same. Let's see this. Torokeru. Oh, there are exact. Oh, no, there are not four. Orisa. There are two. Even though. Maple. Shirapu. And you might think to yourself. Maple. Shirapu. You might, you might shirapu. think, oh, I'm crazy. What do you mean that there's only uh, two when there's actually four? Well, you'd be wrong. They are filled, my friends. Filled. These are sandwiches. Toss oh, me there. one of them, boys. Oh, you're just gonna take one? Oh, okay. yeah, well, baby. We'll, we'll, just, we'll just do this. This. Oh my god. They are so soft. They're so soft. Oh, oh. Wow, Ooh, that smells the, like syrup. The caramel or syrup in the middle. I'm eating it right now. I swear we'll get this to focus. Oh. I guess I could just do this from now on. Mmm. Mm. Mm. This is probably the perfect coffee snack. This takes everything that's good about pancakes mm. and makes them small. Mm. Mm. Oh! Honestly, we probably could make a variation of this at home. Oh, yeah. Although it'd be a little difficult. Mm. Mm. Oh, that's a nine. Oh, that's mm. a nine five, my friend. I get mm. a 10. One of my favorite flavors. Wow. They're, they're really pandering to the Canadian in us right here. Mm -hmm. yeah, a, you want maple caramelly flavors? Here you go. Mm. Oh, it tastes like home. Mm -hmm. It does taste like... Mm. It tastes like breakfast on your birthday when you're turning 12 years old. You come downstairs and you see your presents are on the table. Might as well just split it. Your mom. Yeah, you, you're mm. right. We might as well just why the heck not mm. to save one. No. Made you pancakes. I like this a lot. Favorite. Just spit it into. I don't want it. Well then, I will do that. It'll make it easier for everybody. <clears throat> oh my goodness. And just in case you wanted mm. to see it when it was cut in. It is a nut, but my nut's far too far away. I'm not too far. <laughs> oh. mm. Mm. Although it doesn't have any nuts in it. Mm -mm. I'm fine with that. Mm -hmm. I think that the crunch would have... Well, okay, the, crud of, mm. the crunch of a nut would have been too much. Mm. But like the crisp. Like one mm. well-placed 
You don't like pecans, do you? Mm, no, I don't like them. They I'm, taste I'm like earwax. Oh. Mm, one well placed. I can only think of pecans. Mm. Mm. Oh, so good. So good. That is so good. Maple syrup hotcakes. Just like a delicious tiny pancake. The maple filling on the inside will make you feel like you're eating a fresh breakfast. Yeah. Hot cakes in Japan are sweeter and softer than their Western pancake counterparts, as they should be. As they should be. This distinction is clear as soon as you bite into the soft cake. No need for any additional syrup, though, as the filling between those two honey <laughs> cakes is plenty sweet. <laughs> oh. Oh. I love pecans, too. They're so good. Let's get a bigger one out of the way here. Yeah, that one there. It's in your hand already. There's so much little stuff in the bottom. It's so I cute. believe, and I'm saying that that's a big one. Oh. oh. I wonder <laughs> what this could be. Could they be French fries? No, they're Japanese fries. Oh, of course. <laughs> Silly me. Is there anything French about French fries? It's actually French fried. <gasps> <laughs> oh, no. Don't get me started. <laughs> I love that, though. Eh. Nice. Mm -hmm. Ooh, oh, that smells cheesy. Cheese. <gasps> yes. Cheese fries. Oh, my Lord. I love cheese. <laughs> cheese Put on cheese for fries. fries. Uh, you got to take. A, um, they were in disguise. French fries. Oh, I brought it for you guys. Hmm. Yo, I want all of them in my bag. Oh, man. I took a handful. I don't know. This, this, this is fine. It's not for me, though. Oh. <laughs> well, maybe I'll keep them over here. However, it's going to be me. And mm. I'm fighting. Here, it's like um, salty, salty I'll cheese. A, yeah. I'll have another touch, mm. and then I'll leave the rest with you. I don't think I can do cheese okay. fries on Boxu. Mm. Oh, they were in disguise. Cheese fries. He's actually... Aren't just cheesy as they I thought are they were gonna be. Definitely deep fried. Mm -hmm. These cheese fries. I like it though. Buddha's on the box. Mm -hmm. Taking a train. Definitely not to a mosque. Mm. <laughs> mm. I just. Mm -hmm. They do have crunch. Here, I'll give you a good crunch right now. I'm gonna give a second chance. I don't know. Like, I, I don't like this for the same reason I don't like dried Parmesan. Mm. It just has that like ah uh, yeah, it has that like pungent dried Parmesan cheese smell and taste. I like if you like Parmesan, you would like these. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's where the flavor hits you right there. Mm. Wow, Megahashi giving him a ten. I'm gonna go with a six. A six. Mm. That is your rubber. I'm giving it an eight. I'm giving this a nine mm. five. Mm. Wow. Wow. Mm. You can keep them over there then. Yo, I will. They were good. Oh. I had expectations though, based on the smell. Oh no. Yeah, they, they smelled stronger than they tasted. Mm -hmm. Hope you know that I am keeping them and they will not oh, yeah. be. They will not be here. Oh yeah, Haiti. I love cheese. It's just, mm -hmm. I, I don't like Parmesan cheese. And this is, this is cheddar blue though. Cheese? Have we had, oh, had I love blue cheese. Oh yeah. See, well, oh, sorry. Interesting. I don't love well, uh, I mean, oh. like, I'm okay with blue cheese on burgers, and I love blue cheese sauce. I've never had, like, blue cheese on its own. I don't right. think blue cheese is designed to be eaten on its own, though. So, uh, Blue cheese lovers, unite and let us know. I like it on things. It has a nice earthy texture or taste. Um, <clears throat> Kamakura, Kamakura, yes, queen. Uh, fried potato, cheddar cheese. Imo Yoshi Yakata opened in 1986 in Kamakura to bring back the tradition of Imokan, traditional sweet shops that made sweets with sweet potatoes. Imo Yoshi Yakata highlights the purple sweet potato in particular, making a variety of sweets from their prized ingredient. But this month, we're highlighting one of their delicious savory options. These potato sticks are like crisp french fries coated in a cheddar cheese powder. Not exactly <laughs> traditional, but that's why we love them. Can you, can you read what they're like? Again, that la second to last sentence. These are like French fries. These are like French fries in a cheddar cheese powder. That's exactly what they are. Yeah, I feel like the like is a is a well, no, 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 no. Like French fries. They're not actually French fries, though. Like, 
Yeah, they're, they're but they're crisp. Like, Wait, oh, but they're made out of potato. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. But they're not like traditional French fries. They're like French fries, okay. but they're not quite French fries. I'll accept it at face value. I just, if you got I, those, if you got those fries at a McDonald's or something, you'd be like, "What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> These things are rock hard. They're delicious, <laughs> they're <old>. but they're <laughs> rock hard." <laughs> a lot of blue cheese in chat. Oh. I could live on a diet of just blue cheese. Whiz, I actually think that's not healthy for you. There's a yeah. lot of bacteria in that. Yeah. No, it's good Sorry, for you. Not, not bacteria. Yeah, it is bacteria, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. yeah oh, is. yeah. Mold. The blue is, is mold. But I think it's like milk, though. You can't drink, like, you can't live on milk because you die. <laughs> Babies do it until they that's can't. That's different. <laughs> they actually. I'm not going to get into it. I want the Kurgistat just did a video on whether or not you could drink a lot of milk and just watch that. It'll give you all the information. You can't. I tried. Oh yeah, no, you can't. <laughs> you can't. I don't need to watch the video. I lived it. Your body goes no, bro. no, thank you, no, thank you. But yes, thank you. Look at those happy fishes with the. They fan. got the fans in their mouth. Like, haha, we're here to party. And then the fishermen are like, no, you die. <laughs> They're like, oh. come on board. We have a great party. What's for dinner? <laughs> you. Oh, no. Uh, um, I said I could live in it or live on it. Not that I could live long on it, <laughs> but it would be a happy short life. That's funny. Ooh. These smell like fish. A little bit. Yeah, I guess kind of like those those like um, shrimp snacks. Oh, it's think? like pork rinds, but fish. Yeah, that's it. Fish rinds, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Over I go, oh, that smells fishy. Mm -hmm. I'll take one, but... Things that are too fishy are not for me. Mine neither, but I will try. Mmm, mmm, mm, quite nice. Oh, that's totally great. Yeah, very sweet. No, there's, I didn't. There's no fish. Oh shoot! Wait, did we read the last? Yeah, we did. Yeah, we absolutely did. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm. Yeah, this isn't even. That, and it's not. Yeah, only, sweet. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, they're they're sweet. They're quite tasty. And only to hop back on topic one one time, Will saying no blue or cottage cheese. And I think those are the polar opposite ends of cheesedom, because cottage cheese is super mild and almost tastes like nothing. But the, I think the texture puts a lot of people off. So strong. True. I didn't do cottage cheese for so long. Oh. Um, but um. So I think this is like a red tie, like sweet cracker. This is a seven. I think it's, it's rice. fine. I mm -hmm. think it's an eight. It's quite yeah. nice. It, it's quite addictive. Oh. Let me let me try some more of this. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Tastes fishy. Really? It has like a mild, mild flavor. Yeah, I'm gonna give that. I'm gonna follow you on a taste, seven there. I think I taste rice cracker more than anything. I'm gonna play this and go pee. Oh, okay. Hey, what's up, Dark Defender? Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you for that super chat. Oh, they have a fun name though. Red snapper crackers. Mm. Shaped like a tie. Traditional Japanese red snapper fish. These puffed crackers have a complex flavor that is balanced by a light sweetness. The snap to the snack goes further than just the tie, though. Each tiny fish is puffed to perfection and is wonderfully crisp to bite into. They're glazed with a sweet coating that will have you polishing off the bag before you know it. That's true. I could accidentally eat that whole bag. Absolutely. It was like, oh, I'll keep reaching for a couple cups because they're so easy eating. Mm hmm. They're, yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, if we had a multi-level scale to this, this, I think, would rank higher mm. on the snackability factor. Okay, so these uh, are really interesting. Oh. Come on, gotta be three. <laughs> gotta be three. They're little little Buddha gummies. Little Buddha gummies. Buddha gummies. Oh, look, that one's cola flavored. <gasps> Kora. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. I'll flip this one so you don't lose the focus. This one is uh, oh, still soda. good. Still good until uh, July of this soda. year. Soda. So one is cola and one is soda. I'll take soda. Well, Ooh. you'll get half of soda. Thank you very much. Cool. Kazuichi soda. And I will take all of. Wait, this slice is them soda. into three. Yeah, then you mean a third. Cut them into three. Cut my life into three. Whoa! That smells a lot. Soda. Oh yeah. Oh, I thought that. Okay, so the open ability. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh. That's so interesting. They individually package what seems, I guess, is to preserve them. Sense. It'd be fun to have candies shaped as yourself. Oh, man. And then man. see people eat you. <laughs> oh, that's kind of, yeah. I was weird, just wondering, but... I, was like, I was like, how does Buddha feel about this? 
Buddha doesn't care. That's what it means to be Come Zen. On. Oh, they smell so strong in like a delicious way. I just want to make pretty, sure they don't contaminate. Pretty chill god. <laughs> Buddha? Yeah. I don't even Buddha. think he's really a, a god no. so much. He's no, just he's, a, more he's a guy who's like, yeah. yo, let's be like Zen and stuff. And oh, everyone right was... down. Oh god, I, I think this is wrong. Okay. Who wants soda Buddha head? I'll always take head. Kale. And oh. the gameplay will take turns on the butt as it goes. Okay. okay, so soda first? Soda first! Soda first! Ooh, they're so gummy. Ooh. That's really good. Mmm. 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 It's a very powerful flavor. Soda is so interesting because soda's kind of flavorless. Mm. Well, I, I don't think it's exactly soda. It kind no, of tastes it's, like it's, Ramune to me. Yeah, Ramune. Ramune. And that reminds me, it kind like of feels like if you ate like lemon scented uh, powdered washing detergent. Don't do don't that. Don't do that. Don't no, do that. A, no. they don't. Just like if you drank Ramune. <laughs> yeah. And drink Ramune. You can drink that. Yeah. And this is cola. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Cola's nice. It's like a really, really good version of those cola candies. Because mm -hmm. those cola candies need more flavor. Mm -hmm. The Western ones. Great Buddha gummy, cola, and soda. These two little gummies are mixing tradition and trend with their cola and soda flavors in the shape of Kamakura's Great Buddha. The cola flavor smells like Coca-Cola and is faintly effervescent. While the soda flavor reminds us of a drinking a cold glass of Ramune on a hot summer's day, these gummies are exclusive to this store in Kamakura and can't be found anywhere else in Japan. Wow. The paper you peel back becomes omikuji, or fortune slips, on the inside of the package, <gasps> making them a fun souvenir for travelers. Wait, what? Oh, it does say. I don't know what it says. Oh, no. I don't know either. Get your phone out. Time to... I'll do it. I guess so, so. You don't read us, chat. Chat my note, but they're probably going to say bad fortune. Kichi? What's Kichi? Anybody? Where does it say that? Right below it. Oh. Chu Kichi. Chu Kichi. Oh, actually, it's really interesting because this one, I wonder if I can steal your focus here as well. Good. Just is the, is the exact same symbol, meaning Kichi. This is Chu Kichi. What does it mean, internet? I think one's like good blessing, one's regular blessing, I think. Oh, man. <clears throat> Shoot. I got that good blessing. I think I just got regular blessing. Medium fortune? Too kitschy. What's kitschy? Uh. That's fun, though. <laughs> Sounds good, Jared. Uh, all right. Well, we got four. We got fortuneified right there. That's what did you mean. give those? Oh, mm. um, I would give it an eight. Yeah, an I'd eight? give it a, a an eight and wanting more. I gave it yeah, a nine five more. because I love things that are gummy and soft and taste like uh, Buddha. You're eating. Lemon it tastes like detergent smells. Okay, yeah. you, you don't eat detergent. You don't eat no. detergent. Not even the Annie does that. No, no. but I'm um, like, if you imagine what the take takes the scent. Like. Is fine. We look delicious. We can stop it. Sent with a six Koga. Ooh, unexpected. But they're just a chocolate chip boopy. Oh, chocolate chip boopy. Bop a bit boopy. Bop a must be a vanilla boppity boopy. Oh, bop a bit boopy. There it is. And on the inside, as you may have guessed, we have some more. It smells like chocolate chip cookie. Look at those mm. thick chunks of oh, chip. Yeah, it smells like, like a cookie. Hmm. Very high quality cookie. Mm -hmm. It tastes like a cookie. Mm -hmm. mm. Yep, mm. it tastes like a very, very sweet, and very delicious chocolate chip cookie. Mm. 
Delish. Mr. Tang, you make good cookies. That's that for me is just an eight. It's a cookie. It's a it cookie. Was, it was nice. Yeah, it was really nice. I'm following you on the eight. It was delicious. It was delicious. Clay. Yes. What's the score? What? Number? Oh, uh, I give it an eight five. Mm. It's delicious. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Country ma'am. Fragrant vanilla. Fujia's Country Ma'am is a line of cookies beloved for their rustic, almost homemade feel. This month, we've chosen a fragrant vanilla flavor, which has a soft center and a sprinkling of chocolate chips. There's more than a sprinkling. A lot of chocolate. That, 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 yeah. was, that was, I dare say, a smattering. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, it's a true. classic flavor, which is probably why it's become one of Japan's most favorite cookies since its debut in 1984. Fujia makes all of the Country Ma'am cookies right in Hatano City, Kanagawa. That paired with the red and gold packaging, celebratory colors in Japan, make it a perfect fit for our theme this month. Ooh! Nice. <clears throat> well, that swirly's been trying to hypnotize me for a while. The whole time. Oh! I'm so curious as if it's- Kamakura Yama! I've seen that and I was waiting for it. Uh, I was- I'm curious if it's crisp or if it's soft. Yeah, it is crisp. Look, I'm gonna- get, I, I got something controversial to say. Nyani did it better. What? No. Oh, spiral? No. You can't eat my spiral. Mm -mm. And that's why it's not as good. <laughs> Hot take. If you eat your spiral, I'll think it's better. I can see it right there. The whole paper or just the spiral part? Just the spiral part. Make a, yeah? Make a, I mean, you have to give me a flavor profile on it. Uh, I have to give you a flavor profile? <laughs> why are you adding more steps to just literally eating a piece of paper with ink on it? A flavor? I need, I need a flavor profile? Well, uh, it tastes like paper. Don't do that on stream. We'll negotiate after stream. Don't eat it on stream? Yeah. No one's gonna believe I ate it. I also wanted maybe to give it to someone who wanted it, you know? Mmm, I can I smell the butter. Mm -hmm. If your spy world made of butter, I would say it was better, but it's not. <laughs> you want this? What is it? It's butter. Are you? Ah! Wow, the butter is intense. Mm -hmm. Oh, it, it smells, smells so good. A lot like butter. It's very uh, firm. Tea. Huh. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. If there was such a thing, I'd believe you, Mr. Megahasi. Mmm. Mmm. It's like crispy butter toast. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's just delicious. Uh, just a, a clean, clean 8.5 for me. It is like a light and fluffy crouton. I find that croutons yeah. are a bit harder usually, but it's yeah. uh, it's it's uh, kind of like a flaky. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to give that a 9. Uh -huh. I will give that a 9 as well. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. <clears throat> berry shortcake rusk. I didn't really taste the berry. Mm. I didn't taste mm. the berry. I, I a tasted a bit of spiral though. Yeah. This twice-based... A uh, twice-baked baguette slice has a stunning berry pink swirl in the center. The swirl, or uh, sorry, the white swirl is plain, while the pink swirl carries the berry flavor, making the taste as delicate as the texture. It's finished with a brush of butter and the sprinkle of sugar on top to bring out the sweetness. To create a distinctly crisp texture, Kamakura Yama Rusk lets the bread rest for a day between the first and the second bake. There we go. It's Damn. it's swell. It's real swell. Uh, it okay. As <laughs> you know, what's you yeah. know what's really funny? Yeah. Twice based, uh, twice baked rusk sounds special, yeah. but they literally just toasted it on the second day. <laughs> <laughs> well, the thing is, they it was just toasting once, toasting twice. Well, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, with our toaster, you, we have twice baked toast every single freaking day. You have toast. Oh, yeah, <laughs> Whoever invented toast, the mad lad. Hey, I just baked you some bread. Bake, Bake it again. <laughs> Yeah, that, what uh, what I would do as a kid for my like breakfast mm. is take some toast or sorry some bread, put some butter, some cinnamon, some brown sugar, and then toast that. And it would in a toaster into, oven. In no. a toaster oven, not in a normal, not toaster. a normal toaster. That will cause a fire. This is our first uh, waffle. Or smoke at least. We've never we've never collected waffles on this. It's channel. got a lemon on it. It's I love this. A lemon waffle, very interesting. It's a waffle. waffle Excuse waffle, waffle. me, can I get a waffle? No. Can I get a waffle? Okay, fine. Um, give Chet 10,000 waffles for the waffle. Okay. 
Waffles. Waffles for all. Tasty, we have a waffle. Waffles. You have waffles. Oh. Oh. I thought it was in some sort of uh It was it was air sealed though? Yeah, absolutely. Like, well I mean I thought it was in a little uh I thought it'd be like a little a little thing. Oh it's so delicate and it's so moist. Oh my god, how do they do this? Oh man, it smells oh, show the, show the, show like show citrus. Woo! How did I do this magic? It Ooh. smells good. I love that. I really wow. Love that. I want it so that. dense. Well, let me just hop in on that. Danny's right here, Tom. You can't, you can't say that. <laughs> oh my god, my knife got stuck. Side, it is exactly what you would expect. Wow, it is oh. it is dense. It it is dense. Oh, and it smells very like, yeah. like citrus mm. and feet. Your feet? What? Oh, ooh. Mmm, classic ooh. exclusive. Interesting. Mm hmm. Very delicious though. Very wow. dense. Wow, I was a little scared with how much lemon it smelled like, mm. but. It doesn't yeah. taste a lot like the lemon. No. I just <laughs> this black sort of this black tea is an excellent choice for this box, by the way. Mm. There's like a something kind of Ooh, nice caffeine. in it. Yeah, yeah. It's like a crystal, like a sh uh, a sugar of some sort. Like a sugar, maybe a crystallized oh. rind. I'm not sure. Maybe something like that. Mm. Oh, wow. Mm. This is just so pastry. Mm. That's an eight for me. I mm. like it. Yo. Mm hmm. Nine five. Nine five. Nine freaking five. Mm hmm. It's a good box. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <clears throat> God damn, this it was really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. This box, I don't think I've. Uh, the only thing I gave a, I think a seven to were those little mm. fish chips because they were just a good snack. It didn't blow me away, but everything's been above an eight other than that. Saki waffle. Setochi lemon. We will never say no to a waffle. Oh. <laughs> this waffle is a bit on the denser side, which is good for a richer flavor like this. It is sweet and has a lovely lemony and most aromatic flavor mm -hmm. that lingers. It does. Mm -hmm. It is made with setochi lemons, which are known for being sweeter than most lemons, making them great for baking. While we enjoy this waffle just as it is, we also suggest having it, heating it gently in a toaster or microwave uh. and adding a little syrup for an elevated treat. Damn it. I, okay, I gave a brief thought to adding it, but I'm like, no, I want to try this in its base form. I know. I thought it would just be so Canadian of us to put yeah. maple done, syrup on half it. and half. No. Ugh. I'm not gonna lie, that sounds magical. Yeah. I would only want to put a touch, like to complement the flavors, mm. not drown it. You know, you get an Eggo waffle and you, you drown it in the maple I just think syrup. it was crispy on the outside and then like fluffy Ooh. on the inside. Ooh. Mm. Ooh. All right. Uh, let's go with these look traditional. Oh, um. Ooh, I want have, those. Have we already had one of these? I feel like we've had no. this already. No. 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 We had something that looked similar. A oh, cookie. But. You have the things I want to eat in your hand. Well, I know they're. Oh no! Oh, okay, good. Oh, oh god! Oh no! God, no! <laughs> Not again. Okay, I'm really curious. What is this thing? What are those? They're senbei of some kind. I can tell by the texture that they're going to be crisp and they're going to be nice and they're going to be delightful. Ooh. Holy sashimi! Should have read it first. I know, I know, but sometimes it's nice to guess. Mm -hmm. This is Final Fantasy VII Speed Lit Crazy Motorcycles by Sapphire OC Remix. Well, that's a mouthful. Oh, oh, sorry, you were showing them. Yeah. Your name, your name. I'll get the Ooh, that smells like ah, uh, like uh, it's good. It's a good smell. It's like uh, sesame, sesame. It's like it's like sesame smoky soy. sesame. Mm-hmm, yeah. Okay, yeah, just take the bag, why don't you? <gasps> Ooh, this smells like ramen sesame. 
Mm, maybe even black garlic. Oh shit. Mmm. Mmm. Crunchy. Yep. Oh, that sets me a well. touch yep. of bite to it. Oh, I'm just getting it at the end. It's sesame yep. oil. That's pure sesame oil. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love it. I love it. Mm. Under ten. Mmm. Mm. I'll go with mm. an eight five myself. Wow. I'm going with a, a mm. nine and can't stop. I gave it a ten. Both of you don't deserve it. Spit them out into my mouth, please. Mmm. Uh, yeah. Mm. Mm hmm. That's mm. really, really tasty, really powerful. Maybe a little black pepper. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's pretty good, right, Raga? I love that. Mm hmm. Oh. Yokohama sesame oil okaki rice crackers. Oh, yeah, they got some chili peppers there. These rice crackers don't play around when it comes to sesame. The rich scent of sesame oil wafts in the bag as you open it. Each crunchy cracker is 100% glutinous rice and is coated with both soy sauce, specially brewed from the Minoya Arare and Iwai no Goma Abura specialty sesame oil. Mm -hmm. You okay there, Tom? I just... <laughs> Get fricked, celiacs. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> They're hot enough to keep you warm in winter. The combination of soy and sesame makes these crackers deeply savory and extremely delicious. I guess that's why they won a gold medal at the Monday Selection Award in 1967. Congratulations. Good. Oh, man. Oh. Delish. Mm. So I'm so curious. I think there's only one of this teeny tiny little thing here. Yeah, it does appear that way. What could it be? It's a butter, butter sando. So it's a butter sandwich. Ooh, butter sandwich. Yo, you know how much I love butter cream sandwich. Yokohama butter cream sandwich biscuit. Butter sando. Mm -hmm. That won't fit. What did it do? Yo, we, wow, that is powerful. We joined in the butter cult oh right now. Oh my god. Woo! Put a whole stick of butter in here, I swear. Oh my god! Wow! You'll summon Paula Dean. Stop. <laughs> Honestly, she might just jump through a window right now. <laughs> <laughs> I want to throw this. It's got like, it, it's got like an engraving it. on it, though. Yeah. Oh wow, that. that's pretty. That's really beautiful. Mm. Butter! I smell it! <laughs> it's on your fingers! It's leaking out! Wow, why is why is it a cemetery? It's so cute. Oh my god, it is a cemetery. <laughs> wow. Let's see how we do this. <laughs> oh my god, it's just like it's like literal butter. Man, that is a bold big cut. Oh, I see what you're doing. I'll take this middle piece because it's cracked. Taking the bigger one, you can fight me. It's okay. I don't. Oh my god! It's just so butter. It is. It smells just like, like a butter. Mm. The whole mm. time, I was expecting mm. there to be a tr like not a trick, but mm. like a, <laughs> a next layer. Nope. Mm. It, it has the first layer is butter, and underneath oh, yeah. that layer is butter. Mm -hmm. Definitely Raga. Apparently there's different pictures on all of them. That's a lot of fun. Oh. And uh, the next layer was butter. Oh yeah. Mm. That was that was like super delicious. Mm. Like I mean, this is gonna be. That's a really great coffee snack. Oh man. Oh. I mean, so just sad. No. I I gotta do it to him. That's a 10 nut yeah. for me. You will, like, you will never see that in a November box, No. Not, not, not. It's just really good. So everybody's it, giving it 10s? 10. ten. Just 10. It's so powerful. Mm. And I Except, wouldn't want to eat too many. That's but, a 9. Uh, but the flavor coming out of it, <clears throat> it's just, it's unique. It's different. I wasn't expecting it. Uh, by the way, we have an auditor coming uh, tomorrow, and you need to see you specifically. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you've been... Um, Targeted for some sort of corruption. Mm -hmm. What? Yeah. Why? 
Uh, something about your ratings. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, wow. Well, um. <laughs> yeah. So uh, have your uh, documents in order. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I will be destroying the computers after this stream. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Mm. Butter was so when I was three years old and eating it directly out of the, the container, mm. container with my hands. Yokohama butter sandwich cookie. These butter cookies are a popular gift for tourists visiting Yokohama because each cookie has little vignettes of the city painted on them. Mm. Oh. More than just being cute, though, these cookies are filled with a luscious buttercream that balances the more savory cookies. Takata Seika has been proudly baking in Yokohama since 1946. So many of their cookies feature old-timey symbols of life in the port city. Oh. Megahasi giving it a five. Too much butter. Just agree to disagree. How quickly can we ban somebody? I'm just asking for... They're friend. already banned. That's how fast. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what this is, but I like oh. it. It's beautiful. The yeah. Packaging. Wow. Mm. <laughs> wow. Um. Ah, it's in my eyes. <laughs> uh, I think it's a little spicy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, it's certainly a senbei. Ah. Oh, it's a sandbay! Mm, 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 Too much butter is not a thing. Mm, mm, it's amazing. Stomach. If your dish is, if you're ever like, man, my, my dish doesn't taste quite like I want it to, something's missing and I can't put my finger on it, just put a stick of butter in it. Stick of butter. Awesome. Don't touch your eyes, Clay. <laughs> I mean, look. It looks like I found like a deep sea creature. <laughs> Oh, look at how, look at the texture on that bad boy. I name it the Helix. Yo, if you could, if you like zoomed in really, really close on that, it would be like a really cool landscape. All praise the Helix. Mm. Yeah, well, good luck with that. Yeah, that's all that we're going to get out of that. And yeah, you can just have the... Uh... That hey, large, that I large and charged piece. On the inside, it is uh, very white. White, and fluffy. Oh, oh, that's a smell I like the smell right. of. I think it's sesame and ooh, soy. Oh my god, I love it so much. Hmm. Mm. Mm. It's like salty, savory. Mm hmm. But. There's a, a touch of tang. spice on there. Mm -hmm. uh, it's mm. yeah. There it is. Mm. 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 Wow. Hi. I don't. It is know. certainly like a chili pepper. Yeah, chili pepper. That's good. Mm. Yeah, it's a uh, it's it's chili pepper for sure. Because it just kind of got a spice Ooh, to it. It lingers. Oh yeah, a linger. <clears throat> Woo! Oh, it's so good. Mala Augustin. Augustin. Fried, uh, fried rice cracker. Ryuman Shoji originally began as a Yokohama China uh, as Yokohama Chinatown's mm. first Sichuan restaurant. Mm. Juke Hanten in 1959. Damn, we're going way back here. Mm -hmm. The restaurant still exists today, but Ryuman Shoji now makes snacks so customers can bring the flavor of the restaurant home with them. This yeah. fried cracker highlights their signature spicy mala sauce. You'll crunch into the snack only to find your mouth tingling with flavor from the I'm capsaicum. I'm feeling it. Yeah, me too. I'm, it's, it's that it's that Szechuan yeah. like, makes your mouth yeah. bleed. Mm -hmm. Not bleed, uh, leak. Tingle. Mm. All right. Don't worry. The spice isn't too overwhelming to the point of not being able to enjoy the other treats in this box, month's box after the snack. Aw. Yeah, <gasps> Speaking of that, I think that's our last one. It's these little uh, hard candies. Oh, it's a hard candy, but it's a huge bag of hard mm -hmm. candies. Oh yeah. Yeah. You can use Crave 10 to save 10% of the market. There you go. Or use Neon 5 to get five bucks off the first box. Boop, boop, boop. There you go. Whichever one works best for you. Neon 5. Neon 5. Oh man. Uh that's delicious. We didn't give it a rating. Uh oh, I, that's ten. freaking good. Nine. Yeah, I'm gonna go with a nine for that too. too I like that. It the makes only my thing, mouth tingle. Yeah, mm. I love the flavor. So good. The only thing is that. 
I don't like that much crunch. It's just one Ooh. point too much. I love the crunch. Delicious. Delicious. Mr. Mega Hussy, I can't breathe. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Toss me one of them little boys. That was gross sounding. I'm sorry. <laughs> I... <laughs> so the auditor moved his appointment up. Ow, my <laughs> he's, head. He's, he's at the door. <laughs> wow. These also, it's so Chris funny. Hansen. <laughs> I meant, you know, Look like. Look at this. Called things like long boys and stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, these ones are just little ones. <laughs> At least mm. you didn't say pass me one of them hard boys. Yeah. Uh, it's really pretty. It's so beautiful. Like, I'm blown away at how shiny that is. Ooh. It smells like the inside of a hippie shop a little bit. It's like gold plated is the funny thing. Like, you can see inside it. It's not gold. Wow, you're right. Mm. Subtly lemon. Yeah. Quite sweet. Mm -hmm. It has like... What's the flavor? Try biting down on them. I was thinking about it. I think the inside's a powder. Oh, it is. Oh, oh you're right. Oh, oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Uh huh. Mm. Yep. Hmm. Well, that was interesting. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Hmm. That was a nine that immediately went down to a six. Wow. No way. Yeah, I could agree with six. I, that's not not quite my thing. It's like a bit powdery, a bit crunchy, but it mm -hmm. sticks to your teeth and stuff. I don't know. I'm a, I'm, I'm, I'm a little surprised. I'm, I'm definitely gonna give that a seven five. Mm. Woo. I wonder if I just sucked on it if it would have been better. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Me. Me as well. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, we have a whole bag of them. Shonan Gold Crispy Candy. <clears throat> These beautiful gold candies are made for chewing. Well, that's it. Don't be scared to bite into one. The texture is almost flaky, flaky like no other candy we've had before. It's kind of like your best friend who always bails on you. That kind of flaky. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was in there. No, yeah, no. This type of candy is called the Arijeto. Arijeto, maybe. Yep. And has been made for over 500 years. The what? Arijeto Seizo Honpo brought back this tradition. Every candy is handcrafted with carefully selected ingredients like the Shonan Gold Citrus that flavors this candy. Shonan Gold is unique to Kanagawa Prefecture. And its sweet, fragrant flavor makes this crispy candy very addictive. Mm. I actually uh, forgot to read the intro to this month. Oh, so right. that's my bad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is the classic box, by the way. Classic. And if you do want, uh, you can either use Crave Ten, which is yeah. box who's in, in the market, in the, in the market, market. in the market. You have to buy okay. singular items, <clears throat> or use uh, Nian Five as a code, and you'll get five dollars off your yeah. first box. We don't make anything on it or anything like that, but. Uh, they send us these boxes. They send us these boxes. They're awesome. Reading. So if you'd like your own, you can save some money. Mm -hmm. Happy New Year! We're starting 2020 in Kanagawa. In Japan, the New Year is typically celebrated with lots of delicious food and a trip to the shrine to pray for good fortune. Kanagawa is a great place to experience traditions like Hatsumode. Hatsumode. First shrine visit of the year. And Hatsuhinode. Seeing the first sunrise. Take your Hatsumode, Hatsumode in Kamakura. For its many shrines, or maybe experience the first sunrise of the year from one of Hakone's hot springs. Oh, man, that sounds so awesome. Oh. I remember reading about Hakone, and by reading Hakone. and watching it, because it was run like the wind. Ah. Run with the wind. Throughout these pages the, and this box, you'll be inspired to experience Kanagawa for yourself. So let's dive into this new year with an open heart and a full stomach. <laughs> it reminds me of... <laughs> Uh, Iron Chef. What oh. is it? Yeah. And so we will compete with the uh, with an open heart and an empty stomach, yeah. I think is the thing. Yeah, 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 <laughs> it almost yeah, yeah. feels like a play on that. That's awesome. <laughs> with an open heart and a full stomach. <laughs> We've curated snacks from across Kanagawa to give you a real taste of its confectionery culture. And since this is a celebratory box after all, we filled it with snacks in red and gold. Lucky colors in Japan to bring you the festive feelings and good fortune. Ah, oh, dang. Oh. I feel fortunate to receive this box. Mm -hmm. so I'm gonna play some things. Uh. Hey! Thanks so much to Wiz! Wiz! 19 months. 19 months. Thank you. 
What well, it's oh. no surprise anymore, but it's my birthday. However, I also just reached 2000 hours watch time, which wow. means double the celebration. Oh. Happy birthday again! 2000 pennies for 2000 hours! Thanks so do, much. Do you have plans for your birthday? I hope you do exactly what you want to do and don't feel social pressure to do things other people want you to do. Mm -hmm. Like hang out with us. Oh. <laughs> Speaking of which, we, oh yeah, no. This, thank you though, Wiz, yeah. and and thank you for being here and happy birthday. Oh, I hope things. I hope that this year is very kind to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, um, I hope it's kind to everyone. <laughs> and we'll do we'll do some celebrating. <laughs> oh, you had dinner with your parents stream. and your grandma before stream. Oh, nice. That sounds very nice. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, I'm totally uh, I'm totally getting on my my parents and stuff this year. And I'm being like, no, <laughs> no presents. You can take me out for dinner. But that's no it. presents. No, no presents. No presents. I appreciate the thought. Your but presence no, no is presents. the present, and that's it. Yeah. That's it. Okay. Well, we are actually back streaming in only 30 minutes with some mm. uh, Fire Emblem Three Houses. But thank you, Danny. Oh, thank you, Boxu. So thank you, you guys, yeah. for being here. Right. And thanks for everyone who uh, ate along with us. I really enjoyed having you guys uh, give your the thoughts ratings, as well. The ratings, right? So, yeah. We'll try to be more regular with these. I, I think that we should really should commit to, like, the 15th of every month. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and then and then everyone can know. So I mean, we we can do that now. So yeah, <laughs> want to make the that commitment right now? Is a Saturday. <sighs> well, uh, see you at Fire Emblem uh, Three Houses in twenty five minutes. Uh, the the fourteenth, I guess. Yeah. The uh, Valentine's Day. Ooh, Ooh I mean, it's probably themed, so that'd be fun. But right, I haven't is. seen it. I'd be fine uh, with a Valentine's Day Friday. Yeah, let's do it. Let's uh, watch Bo or eat Boxu, play Final Fantasy VII, oh, yeah. mm -hmm. and then go watch freaking Sonic in oh theaters. My oh my god. Yeah. Oh, that day? What if we get to that part of the game on Valentine's Day? How Ooh. great would that be? Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> I don't know what that means, and I'm excited. <laughs> That'd be fun. Uh, anyway, see you already soon. Goodbye. Bye. 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 14th. 14th. Boxu. Yeah. <laughs>